Hello everyone, so it has come to that time of the year, the end of the year, and I thought why not go back and uh, review or react to uh, the videos I've done from this year. It's not really a reaction, it's more of a explanation, like just talk about the process of the videos I came up with, so, uh, and yeah, just see how uh, the channel did this year, so I'm on my analytics page at the moment. And uh, this is from this time last year. I'm pretty happy with uh, the channel this year overall in 2019. I thought I put a little bit more effort in as well. And as you can see the views and obviously this is from like the Vivid Sydney videos as you can see the top videos there. But let's go back to, let's just go in any particular order, there's no really order here. So let's just start off, why not, let's just start off with the Panasonic one that I've just released. Uh, about a month back, a few weeks, so... Alright, good day everyone! We are yeah, back, back with another, another camera, camera collection video, video and I haven't done, done the, one of these in a long, long time. time. So, so today, today we're going to be, be looking, looking at, at the... I think I recorded it on this camera as well, that's why the audio was a bit out. Uh, I didn't use my mic for this one, so that's why the audio... And I'm still going to use it for this one as well, because I think the audio for this is not bad. Panasonic, Panasonic VHS-C VHS movie, movie camera. camera. So the initial reason for this was I've done a few camera collection videos already on this channel so I thought uh, let's go back and do another one. I've got this one from a family member and it's a very old camera. Uh, let's just skip to that part actually because it's a long video, nine minutes. Uh, and let's go let's to go the to viewfinder the which is this, this one, one right, right here. here. It's a little... So my just talk about, you know, the camera I got and uh, it's, it was so good just to see that again and I did have a few problems with it, the, the audio wouldn't work when I was recording it, like playing it back which I thought was disappointing, it just, something was wrong with it, but the picture was still good and uh, yes, just over there, um, yeah, I just, I just like showing off these things, my initial thought on this channel was just, just to be a photography channel, but now it's more of a photography lifestyle, travel, vlog, channel, like, I like, it all kind of works together though, so I feel like that's what, I'm movie screen, those, those good old days, days. This, this is the ones in the viewfinder, since, uh, I have no idea what any of these mean, so, so let's just uh, skip ahead here, in three, two, one, go. Hi, Hi, how are you? you? It's just, just there we go. Yeah. Sir, how are, how are you? you? I'm going to fade in here. Is it working? It is. Bye. Oh, I'm back. Those videos need to do that now. I like, I like that fade that on the old cameras that they used to do. It's hard to react to one that I've just recently did as well, so I, I've got nothing really to say here, but yeah, I just like showing off the camera collection stuff and hopefully next year, uh, just to point up, maybe do some new cameras along the way. So I thought, uh, let's go back and do my first video from this year was critiquing my old photographs, which kind of ties into the last one, which is critiquing, reviewing, or reacting to the videos of this year, so. Yeah. Well, um, 2019, so, so we're gonna start. Start. Obviously, I feel like the confidence level at the end of the year is much better as well. I feel like I've gotten better in talking overall. This, this year, year. Uh, I'm, gonna I'm gonna be, be reacting, reacting on what is wrong with my lip? There, I also have a pimple on the side and the hair is horrible. Critiquing my own. It's too long, I needed to cut it. Photographs so that it took. What's that? 10, 11 years ago. When I went out. Ugh, it's so cringy. It's a city. city. Is that the city? I can't even tell. Look at all these pixels. So, my initial thing for this video was to react to these old photos that I took from 10 years ago and remember these were taken before iPhones and digital cameras today so much different back then people don't realize like technology from probably 2010, 2011 and even 2008 back then I still had it's, it was this camera here this little old little beauty so yeah it was just go back and just check out some of the photos I've done from a long time and so it's always go back to go back, it's always go back to go back to the start of where you began, so, and, and I say here, yeah, these Look pixels. Look at those pixels. pixels. Look at that. Everything we just had, like, like that, that was a weird time of technology, because it was, 
me just being silly because, you know, no one would have thought of that. It has like, oh, it... So, my thing for this one was the... I don't even know. It was just... Hey, look, a little block. Let's get a close-up of it and its detail and, uh, no. It's... I want to get one of those kind of looking photos. You have something in your up. head and it just doesn't look. detail. Look how clear that is. What is that even? That's like one of those little block things at my school bag. I mean... This yeah, one, this is one of my favourite shots. Because landscapes has always been my biggest thing, so... So that was merely, like, just a little starting point progressing forward into the year of what uh, my videos were going to be about. Ultimate. Yes. Alright, so now I'm going to... Uh, so, real or Photoshop the video. I was happy with this video. This was a little, one little different. This is like the little fun ones I wanted to do as well, like photography games kind of thing. But if you go down, it has three likes and two dislikes. Now, to me, that ratio is actually bad because I don't get a lot of ratio likes or dislikes from most of my videos, like if they don't get many views, obviously. This has 143 views with two dislikes, so you think that's not... I thought this was a good video I planned ahead with, actually presented, and I thought it was enjoyable. Was it because I was bad at it? So I've reckoned these two photos... Maybe because I was stuttering a bit, but you know, that's a bit photo. But I feel like something has been photoshopped out to, you know, like some, like she, And I say that word a lot, you know. She was laying on something. Or she could be floating? Like, is that a... So I did a good, maybe this is where the dislikes come in, because I did a really good start, like talking about some of the photos, and by the end I kind of slacked off a bit. It was after this one, because this one I was got smacked about, but... Yeah, and I put in the post editing with this one, the back, his back has been painted on. Which means it was, because oh, this was real, right? No, this, I was, this, but that one makes sense, I don't know. I think, yeah, my commentary for this one was bad. Yeah. So, door. Now, this was uh, a part two, I guess you could say, for window. Because uh, I had a bit of... Uh, review on window that it was like what the hell was that now if you don't know about that you can look it up on my channel it's eight minutes of nothing pretty much but this one I had an idea of um, it came up from an idea from a friend so I was like door how can I actually make these videos interesting I thought let's get some catchy music and create something with a door but make it like a the door is moving but nothing is else moving around it kind of thing so like as you can see here the door opens it closes but it sinks in with the music and it's like kind of dancing with the music like it's just a little little fun video that I wanted to try and like that that post editing where all I'm doing is just like in the actual Recording I'm just opening and closing the door and every time you see it It's all just cuts of the same video of the same scene But it's just been edited and cut and then edited again So like this I open the door like once twice or three times and then just cut all those together So like I would open it wide I'd open it small close it and then there's another door here that I use that uh, I just I feel like I needed a transition and not stay on the same one so that was kind of the, the reason for that. And then all the rest was just post-edited, like, just with the... And then I'll leave the door <laughs> open. And then it kind of dances with the music again. My favorite part is coming. And it goes... And then it goes... That, yeah. The... the like, that was, I don't know, I was proud of that video. Like, I think there was nothing wrong with it, but this has a dislike as well, with only 30 views. So, it's one dislike, but I thought, oh, what? come on, why? There was, there's nothing wrong with, like, a little bit of, kind of, that, that's fine. Come on, line up. 
Alright, so let's go to some of my editing videos now, uh, which I think... Oh, there's music for this too. See, some videos I like to do commentary and some days I just don't feel like it. I And it's not like a lazy thing, it's not... It's like, I think I'm in a good mood to talk, that's why I'm doing it like this, but some days where I just want to concentrate on what I'm creating and I'm... I can't have that multitask of like saying, okay, I'm doing this, I'm doing this, I'm doing this. I just want to create something in my mind without talking. Because most of the time when I do edit, I don't say a word. I don't like any outside things bar just music. Like, I can listen to music, but even sometimes then it's like, I've got to turn it down to, to focus on what I'm creating. So, so the, the main point was, as you can see here, it's a bright, obviously sunny day, like in the middle of the day, but I created it to feel like it was like a morning vibe, morning sunrise, dust, uh, no, not dust, dawn video. Uh, so yeah, that was like, as you can see, like, I feel like I did a good job. Like, making a sunrise and first job was like, was that the first part? Or second? I think it was the second part. So yeah, again, right in the middle of the day, sun, like a lot of shadows, very contrasty. And by the end of it, yeah, so you can see the original here, before, and the after. So. Like, I tried to make the line of the sun behind the cloud, uh, behind the trees here. And then I actually put in some cloud effect, which actually is in Photoshop. And then I tried to balance the lighting of the, of the background, but like try and like beam it up. So it kind of bounces from the clouds, which bounces onto the, the grass. This is on the fly. This is something where it's like, I'm on the fly. It's not something I did before, it's something I did in the moment. So, like, the fact that I did it in the moment, I'm, I was proud of myself with as well. Alright, so let's just go to some of my Sydney videos now. So, I feel like these are the most popular ones on the channel. Uh, let's start off with the Chinese New Year. Because my uh, last tier one actually did okay as well, it has a few hundred views. Like, I feel like these are good, like, touristy video, like, events that kind of promotes the event or place in Australia, in Sydney. Um, and this all goes back to my first, like, big video that got views, which was Vivid Sydney 2016. I do like things simple, and the main idea was for this, with and with all my, like, Vivid Sydney videos is, get a few clips together, get some good music, like, obviously, YouTube or non-copyright music. Which I feel like the ones, I always try and find music that kind of suits it and always try and find music that can actually view within the video. So I have a video here of what is this channel about and it has six likes, so which surprised me. Uh, let's have a look. What is this channel actually about? Good everyone, so I guess, hi, welcome. So I decided to do a video on what is this channel actually about? Yeah, so my initial thing was finally, let's talk about what I do here, kind of thing. Uh, yeah, just talk about the channel, uh, where it was, where it's going to be now, kind of thing. And it is Nate. Nate. Yes. And Nate. what do I do? Well, what do I love? I love photography. Nate was really made for Nat, for the Nat 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 photography, kind of thing. Mm. Again, simple. Uh, I'm not very good with names, creating names. But uh, looking back, I'm actually happy with the name. I yeah, know. I'm still happy with it. So I like how I put in the, and I didn't bother yeah, to go back and talk light. about it. I put in my LED light, uh, like halfway through. I didn't want to go back and talk about the thing I did because I was actually very happy with what I was saying. So I thought, no, I'll just, I'll just leave. Cameras. They'll know, exactly but. One. It actually and looks yeah, worse, yeah, like, the shadow yeah. looks worse, but it's like, it's like it's Melbourne, Melbourne, so the whole city, city where I'm wearing like, explore, but it's, it's not about, like, like, hey guys, hey guys I'm, here, I'm here, I'm doing this, this. yada 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 yada. Yeah, that's, that's where, where yeah, I don't like doing that kind of thing. Uh, just a nice little simple chill vibe for videos. Uh, I don't like going over the top because that is not really me, can be me, but I don't like showing... That's more acting more than being yourself. I mainly decided decide to go and be the, the Pokemon. And I'm not an actor, so... Alright, my first 
pretty much vlog, I guess. Uh, Queensland travel vlog. I've done like a few already. Uh, so I wanted to see how I go. My first ever vlog, and I I don't really watch these videos much. So let's see how. Really happy with the music and the quality of this video, though. So, so I'm on holidays for the first, first time, time in a while. Obviously, the talking is much better. Uh, yeah, and a few, three likes. So, uh, okay, no dislikes. So, Here we go. See, this is where I'm not acting. This is just me. Like, you see the vlogs where they're like, oh, like the smile and like the, you can tell they're kind of half acting, unless that's them and that's great, but I can't do that. I'm just gonna be like me in that moment. It's like, I'm tired. I got up at 5.40 in the morning to photograph a sunrise, which I'm excited about, but I can't, I can't express it. Six in the morning here. I think th this is not bad actually like this is I haven't watched this at all like even while editing I don't really go back and just view the whole thing I like obviously do but I just like review certain parts I feel like I need to work on my explain explanations for things I feel like can be better but yeah, the music, the editing, I, I think this was a really good video, to be honest. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say why I'm laughing at that. Yo, you know what? I'm proud of that video. I haven't really gone back and watched that. Uh, 84 views. I need to probably share that a bit more. I'm really happy with that. The main thing is just ex just showing off myself, pretty much. That's what. It is. Let's might as well just go to part two. So this is the next one that was on the. Okay, so this is why I wasn't really overall overall happy with the vlogs, cause I wanted to do it in one, but I didn't want to do it in one go, cause uh, it was gonna be too long. So I do it in two parts, but then I thought the first part is good, which, yeah, that's what I mean. It was very good. And then I wanted to do three parts, like another one of the Sunshine Coast and then another one with the Gold Coast. But they weren't as good. And I, this is where I feel like it just, uh, I feel like it wasn't, it wasn't as good. Like just going back. Let's have a look. So this is Glass House Mountains, beautiful area. My presentation for this talking uh, wasn't. I, yeah. Because, uh. Like, some days I just don't know what to say either. Like, it's like, it's beautiful, it's great. There it is. I like this part though. I ran 200 meters from the road to this spot to get this sunrise. I ran with my camera, tripod, and a bag. I was exhausted. That's why it sounds... See, that editing there, because the wind was so loud, I just couldn't even be bothered talking, because it probably couldn't even pick it up, so that's why I had to edit that out. See, the, oh, well that was the other reason. I did the vlog parts of these videos, and then I did a whole, like, uh, another video on the Sunshine Coast as well, without, a like, a vlog style. It was just, like, clips and put together, just like my Sydney clips, uh, which I might show after this. Is it there? See, this is part three of the Gold Coast, which I didn't, we were only there for a day. I was, like, it, there was nothing else to do, but I thought, I'm here, I might as well do something. So there wasn't really nothing else to show off, so there was SeaWorld, um, 
And that was pretty much it, like just where I was staying in Surface Paradise. And then yeah, just the sunrise, which there was no sunrise, it was just... So Sunshine Coast Queensland was the other one I did. This is not a vlog, this was just an overall. And this one won, was... See, out of all of them, this one was the most I was proud with. Mr. Heads. Uh, I think this music was really good. I like this part here. The the wave and the surf and the music. And then I have some clips I made, obviously, but it's mainly more just the clips of like the location, hanging around. So then I have the sea life aquarium, glasshouse mountain. So this was all in one video. This is why I felt like do I do this kind of video or do I do the vlog? So, I've been thinking that these videos are kind of the, the main parts for my channel. Like, uh, so this is the Wildlife Sydney Zoo in Darling Harbour next to the Sydney Aquarium, which I've done three videos of. And uh, yeah, I just like showing off parts of Sydney and like its attractions and places. It's obviously fairly easy to do, uh, so it's just, I just really like doing these things and just showing off to people like, like tourist travel style, um, so yeah, like, yeah, obviously it's just some, getting some clips together, appropriate music, just put it all together and you know, like you're showing this to the world, so like, the, obviously these videos have been done already, but here's my uh, aspect on them as well. Because obviously a lot of done these videos, but like it's for everything as well. So I'm gonna end on obviously my biggest video once again, Vivid Sydney 2019. I think last year's was very impressive, and it's now got a hundred thousand views, which is amazing. Every year I'm proud of these videos. Uh, again, as I've said, I've just created clips put them together with some music that's suitable. And I feel like, again, it was suitable. Like, I really love the stuff I made. Like, Welcome to Vivid, the music. In sync when the lights turn on. Like, that was the start. That was the first clip of the Opera House getting turned on with the lights. Um, and again, I feel like the editing is important here with like, not focusing on one point, but getting a long, like, clips of everywhere else. Uh, of the lighting show, so uh, it's just I'm so happy and I like this part here ready to pump up the music this Yeah, uh, that I'm really I was really proud of how it transpired this all together because This is the first right. This is the first night uh, So I get there at six o'clock lights turn on I'm out of there by 9.30. I get home, I edit the video. I already have the music already, because I feel like this music will work well with the clips, because I kind of know what it, how it's gonna go by, go down. So I have the music already, um, and I already have an idea from the music how I'm gonna set it up. So with that in mind, I put the clips together, and then I work from there, and it's done by 11 o'clock, and it's uploaded. All, all in that time frame. Six o'clock I'm there recording to about 11 o'clock, 11.30, uploading to YouTube because I've done that for the last four years from 2016. I did the same, I started it then. I started then with going there at six o'clock and by uh, late night I'm uploading it and that's how it got views because it was the first night. And it's obviously a, like one of the bigger events in Sydney now, uh, so Obviously, and you can tell by the views, like, it, it's very popular, so, you know, if you're in there straight away, like, you get the views, and that's what I've just been doing, so, uh, it's just, but every, every year since then I thought it's not going to do as well, and it just keeps doing well, like, it's at 73,000 views, it's going to outbeat, I reckon, 2018 eventually, but I think 2018 is still very good. This place out here. 
I like this shot here, the, the vivid, the boat snooping back. The... This was one of the more underrated uh, ones this year as well, which was very good. So, yeah, that's, uh, I guess, my review, my reaction for this year's videos. Uh, yeah, again, I'm very proud of how this year has gone overall. Just, I'm very happy. Oh, I just put the analytics for. So, audience country, obviously Australia, no doubt. United States, India, Indonesia, South Korea. That's the last 28 days. But I, I really want to expand to other countries. Like, I feel like those vivid videos would... Uh, just, I want them to go off to United States, which is a positive. India, India is getting very big now with YouTube, so it makes sense. But like UK could be higher. Uh, UK should be higher. Canada could be higher. Uh, like places in Europe could be higher. Like I, I just feel I just wanted like some like more people from like other countries to view my videos. So I would say that's the thing going forward. Like getting more of an international viewing. I'm not saying a massive, but like I want them to check out like how Sydney and Vivid is this year and stuff. So I'd just say that's my thing going forward. But yeah, no, I'm, overall I'm, I'm happy how this year went, I hope this kind of makes sense of it all, how some of the videos are put together, so that is it for 2019, that, this will be my final video, uh, yeah, thank you guys, and I will see you next year, I will get back to you then.